Oracle Home Architecture in release 12.2. So let's now understand the differentiators in release 12.2 in terms of Oracle Home Architecture versus release 12.1. So as I've explained to you in 12.2, you now have a new Oracle Home, which is called as Fusion Middleware Oracle Home. And obviously it comes with the WebLogic server installed within it. But this part, the Oracle application server 10.1.2 Oracle Home remains same. It has not been replaced. So as you would see in comparison with 12.1, what is new? The Fusion Middleware based Oracle Home, which has replaced the 10.1.3 Oracle Application Server Home. But in terms of database home, it still remains the same, but database has been upgraded to 11R2. Now, let's compare it with the 12.1 architecture. So, as I've explained to you earlier, the three homes out there in the database and you've got rest of the two homes in application tire within 10.1.2 AS and 10.1.3 AS based Oracle homes. And as you could see now, this has now been replaced totally. And what you get now is fusion middleware based Oracle home. In fact, the directory structure has also changed. So let's have a look at the directory structure as to how it looks like in 12.2 so this is how it looks like in 12.1 but in 12.2 the directory structure is slightly changed as well so you now have a completely new top level directory called as fusion middleware home and within that if you look at that it's got complete directory structure for for storing the java applications the web logic server and the web tire or nothing but you know the one which invokes the HTTPs and the associated child directories but the 11 sorry but the 1012 directory in EBS apps still remains out here so you can see this is where it contains one of the Oracle homes so going back um, in terms of this so let's just go through uh, one by one the points that I've written out here perhaps there could be few other things that may come up which I would have missed it so application tire Oracle homes and release 12.2 Oracle eBusiness suite uses two Oracle homes as I've explained to you uh, and Oracle application server 10.1.2 Oracle home that was used in previous releases which is what I said and then you've got a completely new fusion middleware based Oracle home which contains the WebLogic server and it supersedes the previous Java based Oracle application server 10.1.3 Oracle home. The use of these two Oracle homes enables Oracle eBusiness Suite to take advantage of the latest Oracle technologies. So what are the latest technologies? The latest technologies are nothing but the WebLogic server and the WebLogic Java server pages which is called again within the WebLogic server. In terms of key changes, key changes is all major services are now started out of Fusion Middleware Oracle Home instead of 10.1.3 application server based Oracle Home. The Fusion Middleware Oracle Home or which is sometimes referred to as a web or Java based Oracle Home replaces that Oracle AS 10.1.3 based Oracle Home used in eBusiness Suite 12 dot one dot x releases prior to 12.2 so these are the key differentiators and these are the key differentiators in terms of the file systems architecture which i will explain you in a little while in the next movie